Hi folks, I'm going to show you how to wire up MVR switch with an emergency stop. Okay, this particular one it's going to go onto the drill press at some point. Okay, but that's going to be a separate video. As I say, what I'm going to do for the time being is just show you how to wire it up. So on the drill press I've got on off switches there. But as you can see, it's not got an emergency stop. That's the power in, 240 volt supply, and that goes to the motor. So in essence, how it works, power goes in there, through the switch, out to the motor. Again, as I say, at some point, all that is going to be um, replaced. So when I show you how to wire this up, that's going to act as our feed-in, our 240 volts, which is there. And this piece of cable is going to be for the motor which is there so I'll unscrew these and we'll have a look at the connections inside so the final screws out then we'll just take it apart so we've got the housing and the switch itself and these are all the various terminals which I'll go through when the housing various knockouts as you can see holes there as well which can be drilled out and you can fix it to a surface area in respect to the switch got the emergency stop so that pushes in to reset got to turn it so again pushes in to reset got to turn it and it pops out so we've got the terminals inside number one Number two, turn it over, number three, and number four. So regarding the on-off switch, again, it's got terminals on there. So it's number 24, top right, bottom right is 23, bottom left 13, and top left is numbered 14. One, and six. Right, so let's assume then this is our power cable from the mains, i.e. our 240 volt supply. We're going to connect that up first of all. The brown, or the live, that goes into terminal number two on the emergency stop side so we'll do that now okay that's done so the blue or the neutral cable that connects over to the switch side and it connects to the terminal on the bottom left which is numbered 13 however to do that we need to put on a spade connector. So I'll crimp that up. There we go. So once they've been connected, we're going to make a bridge from the emergency stop, number one terminal, to the switch, number 23 terminal. So that's been screwed in there. Put another spade connector onto the end. I'm just going to pop that on there. And then we'll just tidy it up. And that's the power connected. The earth that actually goes onto the body of the drill. So that's not actually connected to the switch. Okay. Right, so the power feed is connected. Again, just to reiterate, we've got an earth which goes to the body of the drill. You've got your live that goes to the emergency stop and you've got the neutral that goes onto the switch side. So that's a power feed connected. So the cable to the motor, again, just to save time, I've put on some spade connectors. So we've got our live, our neutral, our earth. So the live is gonna go onto the switch side and it's gonna go onto terminal number 24. Our neutral, again, is going to go onto the switch side, and this is going to go onto terminal number 14. Again, our earth, it goes onto the body 
of the drill. All right. So that's our feed to the motor, and that's a power supply in. And that's how you wire up an NVR with an emergency stop.